Bishop takes Rook. Of course, Woods knew what it meant. Adler was pointing us somewhere. The Black Sea. According to Woods, 15 years ago, he and Adler discovered an abandoned KGB safe house in Bulgaria. It was called the Rook. Last year, before Adler disappeared, he'd been chasing rumors of a dangerous paramilitary group on receiving orders from inside the CIA. He believed the Pantheon was developing a new type of weapon with plans to unleash something the world had never seen before. And wouldn't you know it, soon evidence surfaced incriminating Adler himself, and he fled to this place. What we found here over the last couple days has changed everything. Now I'm questioning what I believed about Adler, about Livingston, about the CIA itself. I have my doubts about going dark on Jane. Woods might be right about her value on the inside, but she'll be in the crosshairs if Langley learns what we're up to. Adler brought us here for a reason, to stop the Pantheon before they strike. To do that, Woods believes we'll need him back. That won't be easy. But Adler left the name we'll follow. It's a good place to start. No more wasting time. You know the plan. Savadi Duma, the person you're gonna meet. Still no idea why Adler was in contact with her, but a lead's a lead. We can't trust her. I doubt if Adler did. Hell, for all we know, she's part of this fucking Pantheon thing. Who can we trust? Duma agreed to meet Case in Avalon, so we're doing this. I can't stand the son of a bitch, but we need him. Sometimes you just gotta hold your nose. If he's as good as you say he is, by the time Case gets back, we'll have located Adler. If Livingston hasn't already stuffed him in a barrel. Our details are up on the board, Case. I'm headed out, so hit me up soon if you need anything. I've got a few ideas on how we can polish this turd of a safe house case. Let's talk when you have a minute. <sighs> All right. What kind of life savings you got? <laughs> ah, no wonder you're still alive, Case. Always serving up the top sirloin of bullshit. I'm gonna cut to it. We can't do shit with this house, considering our money situation. This place might have been fine for Adler, but for a team? I'm thinking overhaul. An armory. Place to train. Gear bench. Not to mention anything else we might end up needing. There's that won't be free, though. Marshall found a few grand stashed in one of the rooms upstairs. Other than that, we're starting fresh. No touching our own bank accounts, either. Someone will be watching. When you're on a mission, look around for any cash lying around. You're gonna Robin Hood your way through this. Steal from the rich and give to the poor. That's me. We were following an old KGB trail and a single recording let us here. Seemed abandoned. When we asked our mole inside the KGB about it, he knew nothing. Belikov thought maybe it was some kind of splinter group, not sanctioned by the Central Committee. Whatever it was, it doesn't look like a red-stepped foot in here since 1968. Yeah, I don't think he wanted to get others involved. Looks like he was working on a trust list. As far as I can tell, he didn't contact anyone. That's probably why Adler was talking to Dumas, keeping it outside of Langley. We're gonna do the same. At least for now. The board behind me is how we'll track our spending. Give it a look.
Adler didn't leave much intel on Savati Dumas, but I can tell you a thing or two about Avalon. It's a playground for the filthy rich, and crime factions run the whole city. Everyone's looking for who to push off the slide. When they pick a target, they hire someone like Savati. She used to be part of the guild, one of the most powerful Avalon factions, but now she freelances. Savati said that Adler hired her to follow a Pantheon trail. So you're gonna join her on that job tonight. We wanna see firsthand where that trail leads. Maybe we'll even add some muscle to the team. You'll scratch her back, but sure as hell watch your own. Trust is gonna be earned. under the phone booth. His name is Yannick, a broker for the guild. He'll be on his yacht tonight taking a call with the Pantheon. We'll be listening in. Once that call is finished, you'll finish Yannick. That'll draw the target I really want. But first things first. The bell tower on that church offers an open view of Yannick's yacht. He's throwing a party while his men count money in the church. Yannick traffics in weapons, narcotics, women. Whatever pays. Rumor has it the Pantheon wants a relationship with the guild. So Yannick is testing the waters. He's only our first domino. The real fun starts after we knock him down and get access to the target I really want. Johannes Edi. Close enough to know if you screw this up. Let's see what you're made of, Case. Get to the bell tower. I don't care how. Quiet, loud, just get there. You're lucky no one heard that. You could go for a swim, avoid some guards. Reçu. Allez-y. Tout va bien? Rien à signaler. Once we listen to Yannick's call and confirm a Pantheon lead for Adler, I'm declaring open season on the Guild. They have it coming. I should know. I used to work for them. I never cared for Yannick's parties when I was with the Guild. Though they were good practice in how to blend into a scene. Any girl who caught Yannick's eye was in for a long night. So let's cut his short. That clown shit. Typical Yannick. The water really carries the music. Yannick does it right. Best drugs, best girls, worst music. Windows are open. Could climb up to the second floor. 
Access to the bell tower is only second floor behind the locked door. C'est quoi ça Entendu. Bien sûr. Découvrez ce qui se passe. Contact. Oh. Yannick's expecting a call from Pantheon any minute. This morning I stashed the rifle at the top of the tower. Remember, Case, don't pull the trigger until we hear his call. We need to confirm any connection to Pantheon. Yannick's near the umbrella. Upper deck, left side. Surrounded by girls. <sighs> Got your advance. My boys are still counting it. It's all there. Remember, this deal is one and done, huh? Don't need to get mixed up with the CIA. Or your pantheon thing. You'll send the hardware tonight, understand? That's not what we agreed to. Tonight. Yannick, don't test me. So the Pantheon and the CIA are connected somehow. We got what we need. Take the shot. <laughs> Woods was right. You are a good shot. Yannick was just our first domino. We have more work to do tonight. Head back towards the payphone. I'll pull up in a white van. Guards inbound. Word on Yannick got out. Find the van. I hear sirens. Fall back to the church. You're in the clear case. Let's go, case. Hey, turn it down. That's Gabriel up there. He's cool. They called an emergency meeting at Chateau de la Haute Lune. Three guild leaders will be in attendance to smooth things over with Pantheon. I want to get paid, so we're going to crash that party. Chateau de la Haute Lune, let's go! The guild will lock the restaurant down and meet in a safe room on the second floor. 
door can only be unlocked from the inside. You're gonna help me get that door open. We're a few minutes out yet. Just enough time to get changed. There we are. Fits for guild security. Personally, I want these guild bastards dead. Pantheon's the icing on the cake for me. This is my stop. Get to the safe room's antechamber on the second floor. An alarm will go off. That's okay. The guild doesn't know you. So your best option is to surrender and play along. When you get inside, wait for my cue. meeting Pantheon right now. Get inside and find the safe room. Of all the guild assholes meeting tonight, the Sadie is the biggest. If we can't get them, consider me a no for your little club. That wine was shit. Why do I have an extra glass? can drink after they're done meeting upstairs. <laughs> The safe room is upstairs. C'était quoi? Subit des tirs. D'accord. Va inspecter ça. Don't move, Case. Stay calm. 
pocket. Play along. It's for my signal, not before. Timetable's moved up. I want that shipment sent tonight. You CIA types are all the same. And this one? <laughs> Troublemaker. What's going on in there? We have a visitor. Walked right into the lion's den. Alone. Uninvited. Maybe this one works for a rival, huh? Or maybe Pantheon is trying to squeeze us. We came to you, Asaidi. We learn the truth one way. <laughs> or another. Show me your business. <laughs> Go ahead. Well, look at that. You're a long way from home, Case. This man is extremely dangerous. Kill him immediately. Aminata. Bastards don't even recognize me. Not that it would save them. They have guns! Somebody help us! Everyone clear out! Ah! To say that they top down off for meat shields. Throwing Molotov! down the street. Adler was right. The CIA might be behind Pantheon. Let's hope he isn't right about their mystery weapon. Maybe it's time you take me to this safe house of yours. Got word from Case. Savadi Dumas agreed to join us at the Rook, so we're two for two. I'm returning from Munich with Felix Newman. Newman's cut from a different claw, a brutal Stasi enforcer and a tech genius. He used to be a pain in the CIA's ass. That was before he gave the middle finger to the Stasi and defected to West Germany. Newman claims he's moved on from a life of violence and doesn't even arm himself anymore. But one way or the other, he couldn't turn down a chance to stick it to the CIA once again. He'll get that opportunity soon. He's gonna try to break into Langley's network and find out where they're holding Russell Adler. <laughs> 